Seriously? I'm looking forward to it. Here are my requests. Wonderful. Is that true? You have my thanks. You 
must know. A report of success. Very well then. If you call me die, do you have this all for this last I should follow. So we select the number of toppings ourselves. I see. How interesting that they leave that to the discretion of the consumer. Now then, let us begin. Bon appétit. flavor. I thought it's strange at first, but it carries with it a subtle complexity. Yes, this is quite delicious. Excuse me, Monsieur Chef de Cuisine? Chef de Cuisine? Talking to me? Your ramen is absolutely wonderful. It's been a while since I last gave my compliments to the chef. What do you use for the bouillon? Bouillon? What the hell is that? You're asking about the recipe? Sorry, miss, can't tell you. That's how we put bread on the table. So it's a secret recipe. I completely understand. You don't have to tell me. You mentioned this dish puts bread on the table? I suppose. That means it comes in sandwich form as well. I see. What a fascinating delicacy. Uh, that ain't exactly. Well, whatever. The recipe of something this delectable could likely be patented and sold for quite a profit. Oh, sorry, um. My imagination got the best of me. I've been wanting to try ramen for a long time. <sighs> Do you find that... unusual? I see. I would have been free to visit as I pleased, but... Dining alone is... rather awkward. I would love to return here in the future. I am thou, 
Notice the time. We should be going. really good when they're freshly harvested. I think that about does it. Shall we head back downstairs? Hmm. What am I drawing? Why is this? It's been a while. That voice! I'm glad to see you once again. Jin, the instruments if you would. Here. Don't tell me you can't even recognize your own evoker. Now there's nothing in the world keeping you here, yes? Takaya. Surely you understand. There is nowhere for you to go. Your only choice is to come with us. You know all too well that death is not to be feared. You need only fear. I know, Takaya. Excellent. It's all his fault. Ever since he started getting too close, I've suffered every single day. And now, I'm afraid to die. Hey, Jidori, hurry it up. <sighs> Mandia? Let's go.
its amazing commodities! I'm going to do it! Good, good! Not bad, kid! Thanks, kid! Bye-bye!
I'd been writing more of my story. How much did I tell you about? Oh, right. The pink alligator and the bird became friends, right? This was the alligator's first friend, and he was very happy. They started going to the river every day, and the alligator would listen to the little bird sing. But the pink alligator still had trouble hunting because of his color. He was so terribly easy to spot, and his prey always had plenty of time to escape. Eventually, he became so hungry that he grew dizzy. And one afternoon, he accidentally ate the bird as it slept in his mouth. Of course, he immediately realized what he'd done. He drank swamp water to vomit his friend back up. But it was too late. The bird was already dead. After that, he couldn't bring himself to eat anything. That's as far as I've written. I haven't decided on an ending yet. Oh, is it really that dark? For me, it's hard to tell. The words I use come from my own life. I don't really have a point of reference. But I see. So, this is depressing for others. You know... When I mentioned I was writing a diary, that was a lie. I was writing my will. I couldn't face reality, and I was essentially screaming curses into my notebook. For now, though, I'm writing my story in the same notebook. It probably isn't very good, but it contains some things that I've learned during my short life. When it's done, I'd like you to be the first to read it. Meeting you is why I started writing it, you know. I've been trying to come up with a good ending, but I just can't decide. And I'm running out of time. I've got to go now. But I hope to see you again. Welcome back. Um. Inside of my mouth still tastes all. Uh, I mean, coffee's meant to be taken black, don't you think? It's the only way to experience the natural taste of the beans. The one from Brazil is very smooth, while the Kilimanjaro one is more sour and full bodied. Oh, um, it's called a value pack blend. I bought it at the supermarket. Does the quality of the beans really affect the flavor that much? Maybe I'll try some better ones next time. Anyways, sorry for the sudden invite. But they say that drinking coffee can help you relax and concentrate better. I just thought something like that might benefit us in our upcoming battles. And I figured if I could learn to make good coffee, people might find that useful. I'll do some more research. I can tell there's room for improvement. Sorry for asking you to help me clean up, too. Please, take the leftovers with you. Although, you might not necessarily like it. Shh. 
Sure, I'd prefer my coffee to taste good, but I could do without all the test sips. Now, it's not that I don't appreciate the flavor. It's just that it's not good for an elementary school kid to drink too much, so... And you seem like someone who'd appreciate a good cup of coffee, like from a cafe. I hope you have another cup the next time I make some. I'll make sure it tastes better by then. <laughs> well then, good night. Yamagishi detected a presence. Other Persona users, they're outside Tartarus. Other Persona users? You don't mean... Strega. They're still alive. Those bastards! First the Dark Hour doesn't go away and now Strega's back? What the heck's going on? Yamagishi, can you see who it is? One of them, but I thought she was in the hospital. Huh? No, she's she's inside. Ah! What's wrong? Long time no see. Chidori. She hijacked the transmission. I can't stand the sight of you all anymore. So I've decided to get rid of you. Come to me. <sighs> Yamagishi! I'm... okay. I don't get it. Wasn't she in the hospital? Junpei, do you have any idea what's going on? <sighs> Junpei? Shut up! I don't know shit! God damn it! What? Junpei, come back! This is almost certainly a trap. But it's Strega we're dealing with. We can't just ignore them. And if we confront them, we might gain some insight on the current situation. Please be careful. I only sensed one person. The other two could be nearby. True. Leader. We have no idea what they're planning. So choose your team wisely. We'll go after Iori once you're ready. Excuse me. smart and I've done a lot of stupid things but this this is wrong we shouldn't be fighting each other Jinpei-kun look out oh! 
Hey, that was close. You could have killed someone there. Yuri. Why? Get back, Junpei. Talking won't solve anything now. It's too dangerous. I know how you feel, Junpei-kun. But please, just back up. Medea. This isn't where I belong. I've known that from the start. Chidori! What the hell's gotten into you? Get ready. Some serious damage. What to do? The bullet! I have to do this. Come on, Persona! That'll help. Appreciate it. I'll take care of this. Let's do it! Caesar! I was careless. What's the plan? I'll show you! No! Takaya was right. You're all just a nuisance. Get ready! Oh, that was close! Some serious damage. I'll go with. White Rider! In this situation, Isis! Thanks, thanks. One step at a time. I was careless. What's the plan here? Go! Artemisia! This pain is nothing compared to the suffering I'm feeling inside. This is nothing. I don't feel it.
told you. Don't touch me. Chidori, please. Tell me why you're doing this. What I fear most isn't death. What I fear most is attachment. When I do, I become horrified by the thought of loss. My possessions, my life, everything. That's why we only ever live for the moment. But you, Junpei, you brought me pain I never wanted. What? When I'm with you, Junpei, I fear everything. I fear loss. I fear death. I fear my time with you will end. That's why I... Shidori. That scent! What is it? It's the others from Strika! How did they... Bastards! You just don't know when to give up! I refrained from interfering as requested, and look what became of it. Chidori, I see that it is too late. You've been poisoned by them. What the hell does that mean? You freaking ghost! Ha. I am no ghost. Fate simply permitted me to live despite my detachment to life. You might say I was... chosen. Bastard! That's it! I'm not letting you do this to her anymore! I'll protect Chidori with my life! Junpei... Chidori, come with me! Don't stay with these guys! Hey, look out! wrong. My fear, my heartache, I blamed it all on you, Junpei. I'd never felt that way before I met you. And for the first time in my life, I... I realized what I wanted. And... what's that? I... I want to be with you, Junpei. Forever. I... Um... Uh... I... I want to be with you, too. But it could never last. And it breaks my heart. We are different from you. Since the moment I gained my power, I've known the day I was going to die. Huh? The very thought of it horrified me. Up until then, I'd never once thought about death. But I realize now, dying means I won't see you anymore. Chidori. That's why this is for the best. You can't die here, Junpei. I... What?
<laughs> what the hell? Junpei-kun! Junpei! It's her persona. Does it have the power to bestow life? I don't believe it. She brought him back from the dead? But wait! If she goes as far as completely reviving someone, the cost for that would be... Shh! <laughs> Chidori! <laughs> So it worked. I can hear you. The sound of your beating heart. But dumb. But dumb. <laughs> That's all I needed to know. Now I can go on living in you. I'll always be with you. Huh? Hey, Chidori! Stay with me! What the hell are you even talking about? Hey! This is how it has to be. Don't worry. I'll protect you, Junpei. Always. Yeah, same. I've got your back. I'll do everything I can to protect you. So come on! <laughs> this might be all I ever needed. Just being in each other's arms. It's nice. Chidori! I love you. Jubei. Thank you. <laughs> Chidori. You're kidding, right? Chidori, say something, please! Pitiful. Such a meaningless end. Meaningless? Hmm. Quite a spectacle. Now, allow me to respond in kind. Takaya, don't! Don't forget about your mission. You don't gotta waste any more time on him. Hmm. I have a much greater purpose to fulfill. And since you have no means of destroying the Dark Hour, there's no point in dealing with you any longer. Enjoy squandering what little time you have left. Get back here! Junpei! Let me go! I'll... She entrusted you with this life! Don't just throw it away. Chidori. 
Kirori. I... I... Oh, God, this is so hard. But... It's not just my life anymore. Junpei, 